Hello, this is GeotechLand, and today I'll be playing Uncharted Drake's Fortune on the RPCS3 emulator. So I'll be using version 0.0.5-6847. And while this loads here, I'll show you guys the specs that I'm running on or the settings. So I'm using the Vulkan API as usual and everything else I leave as is. CPU I kind of just leave it as is. And so let's get started here. So a couple things to note since my last video on Uncharted is that I now did notice a boost in FPS not that much maybe like one or two or three fps but it's definitely enough to make a difference now the gameplay itself feels a lot smoother and i still have the issue where i can't get past to the second stage so that's still the biggest issue using these AMD specs, you know, my RX 580 and AMD Ryzen, although looks like it's mostly a driver issue. And so I'm gonna actually start a new game and put it on normal. And so the main issue I've been having though is um, like I said, I think it's a, just an AMD graphics driver issue that doesn't let me get past the second stage and likely is what makes my FPS not as good as you may see like on NVIDIA GPUs. But as you can see, it does hover, it gets closer to 5 and 6 more often now. And the gameplay itself feels a lot more fluid. got them both now another thing i notice is that the level itself here looks a lot clearer so i can so it's twofold i've noticed some visual improvements and some slight fps improvements so overall it, it makes a big difference uh, this scene here comes through a lot faster so it's caught me off guard a bunch of times when I was like chilling and wasn't expecting these guys to start showing up but lo and behold they do show up a lot quicker and I can aim a lot better now the aiming is much more accurate with these slight FPS improvements so if you're on an NVIDIA GPU, you've probably noticed even more FPS improvements. Now at first, I, when I first played through it, I didn't have an issue where it would just crash and just stay frozen. But my last video when I was trying to do the first recording, I guess you can call it the first take, it actually crashed on me and, and um, I had issues with sound in that video so I thought alright. I got to do a new one, a second recording here. Yeah, uh, if you guys saw my last video, you guys probably noticed the difference. The aiming and just the gun battles here feel a lot faster. Now, I, I guess a big issue that I noticed though, I guess since the visual and FPS improvements is that the sound, I've been having issues with sound in this intro clip, like in the intro movie clips, the, the chick, I forgot her name, she, her, her voice cuts in and out, so sometimes you'll hear her, sometimes you won't. I guess Nathan sometimes also, maybe once or twice, but so yeah, there is an issue with sound. So it's almost like it took two steps forward, one step back. At least for these specs. Okay, that's not good. Gotta 
run and hide from this boat with the Gatling gun. Let's see if we can make it past this. This clip here. But yes, right now it's sitting at about 6 FPS, which again is a big difference than 3. So you can almost say it doubled. I guess that's why it feels a lot more fluid. And it, even though it did crash last time, it appears to happen a lot less frequently. But alright guys, other than that, some noticeable FPS gains, some noticeable visual improvements, but some issues with sound now. Still can't get past to that second stage, but I'll keep you guys posted. May maybe post my next video when I do finally get past that second stage if ever, if AMD ever fixes the issues they have with their drivers, but... Alright guys, if you found the video helpful, please like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.